Hi friends, what's up? This is RK from 360 Reader. Right now, I'm going to talk about the best tips and tricks to fix touchscreen unresponsive issues in iOS 15 on iPhone and iPad. A large number of iOS 15 users have reported that the touchscreen on their iOS and iPad OS device doesn't seem to work or it seems to get completely frozen at times. If the problem has hit your device as well, these solutions can come in pretty handy. That all being said, let's cut the chase. Before getting started, make sure you have subscribed our YouTube channel and hit the bell icon so that you won't miss any update from 360 Reader. First and foremost, I would recommend you to force restart aka hard reset your iPhone or iPad. For those unfamiliar, force restart is well known for fixing common iOS or iPad OS issues, therefore it is apt to give it a try. On your iPhone 8 or later and iPad with our home button you have to press and quickly release the volume up button then you have to press and quickly release the volume down button and then you have to hold down the side button or the top button until you see Apple logo on the screen and on your iPhone 7 or 7 plus you have to hold down the volume down button and the side button until you see Apple logo on the screen and on iPhone 6s or 6s plus or iPad with the home button you have to hold down both the home button and the side or top button until you see Apple logo on the screen. While this is not a full-on solution per se, I would also recommend you to remove the screen protector from your device just to ensure whether the problem is with the touch screen of your device or with the screen protector itself. There are so many cheap screen protectors that tend to become unresponsive after a while, so give it a try. Next up, I would also recommend you to update all the apps. Outdated apps are well known for creating a number of issues like crashing, freezing or even causing the device to slow down or even overheat. To update all the apps on your iOS or iPadOS device, launch App Store and then tap on your profile at the top right corner. Now you can update all the apps at once or one at a time. If you haven't yet been able to fix the touchscreen unresponsive issues in iOS 15 or iPad OS 15, I would suggest you to reset all settings. Do not get panicked because it doesn't wipe out any media or data, it simply erases all the existing settings. To get it and open the settings app on your device and then choose general. Next up, you have to scroll down to the bottom and then tap Transfer or Reset iPhone. After that, you have to tap Reset and finally choose Reset All Settings and then confirm the action. If the problem still persists, then it's time to update the software. More often than not, Apple releases software updates with plenty of bug fixes and performance improvements. Therefore, chances are pretty high that updating the software can help you troubleshoot this problem. To get it and open the settings app on your iPhone or iPad and then choose General. After that, you have to tap on Software Update and finally download and install the latest iteration of iOS or iPad OS on your device. That's pretty much it. So that's how you can fix the unresponsive touchscreen issues in iOS 15 or iPad OS 15. Hopefully you have finally got rid of the issues and your device has started to work normally. Now that you have fixed the problem, let me know the solution that has worked for you. Besides, if there is any hack that works in fixing this problem as well, do let me know in the comments section below and I'll see you in the next video with more such handy tips and tricks. Till then, stay safe and have a great time. Bye-bye.